fellas this is schematics again to the solution welcome back to another video tutorial so it is good to see you again once again for a long time since i haven't been making videos for a long time it's good to see you again fellas so well fellas it's re re really late it's been re really re it's been really late uh, for making videos for you fellas i'm really sorry for that well fellas now today we gonna solve a uh, question related to uh, edexcel gc chemistry okay so today in this video tutorial we gonna solve uh, a question paper recent question paper of chemistry of unit 4 okay june 2016 so let's get back to the question consider at first let us read this question Consider the reaction. This is the reaction given over here. Equation for the reaction is given over here. Okay. So the question says, consider the reaction, and the equation for the reaction is given over here. This is an example of acylation, hydrolysis, substitution, transesterification, or which one should be? Okay. So before answering this, before answering this question, before answering this question at first let us analyze this equation given okay so if we analyze we can see that this is an ester okay so uh, this is an ester and here this is alcohol which is methanol in this case this is methanol so this is an alcohol okay so this is another ester and this is another alcohol that is formed okay so as as you can see here as you can see th that here this is the reaction between ester and alcohol okay so this is the reaction between ester and alcohol okay so in here this portion uh, if we observe carefully over here uh, this part of the ester of this ester of this particular ester gets substituted with this part of this alcohol okay this part of this alcohol uh, which is then changed in this product okay yes. so so here uh, this part of this alcohol gets swapped with this part of this ester are forming this as the product okay so here we can see that here these things get swapped suppose uh, let us uh, name this as r1 and this as r2 so eventually this becomes r uh, r2 in this ester part and this becomes r1 in this alcohol part so simply here when this ester reacts with this alcohol uh, forming another ester and another alcohol okay so here in here what is actually happening here is this part of ester get substituted with this part of this alcohol as you can see that in this in this part that was c2h5 okay and the, in this part of this alcohol was ch3 so in this product we can see that ester having CH3 this ester having CH3 and this alcohol having C2H5 so eventually we can see that this just get simply swapped and that is actually happening over here so the alcohol part of the ester gets swapped substituted with the new alcohol okay so this this is the alcohol part of this ester so uh, we all know that ester has two part one is from the carboxylic acid and another is from the alcohol so this part is carboxylic acid part and this part is alcohol so in this case the alcohol part gets uh, get substituted with this part okay so this part gets substituted um, r1 gets substituted with r2 okay so here this just gets swapped 
here before that uh, that was r1 r2 now it has become r2 r1 okay so here uh, we can see that this is uh, this is the reaction called transit esterification so this actually happens in transit esterification so this uh, reaction is basically trans esterification okay so this is the trans esterification reaction so in trans esterification reaction uh, what is what basically happens that the ester uh, uh, in ester the alcohol part of the ester gets swapped with the new alcohol that that is reacting with this ester forming these new things okay just this part get swapped with this part that's ac actually happens in the transistor transistorification okay only this part get swapped with this part and that is the only change happens in this reaction okay so this is what is uh, this is this is the basic criteria of this reaction okay so if if we see that if the alcohol part of this ester get swapped with this alcohol over here in the product okay in the new product here this is uh, ch3 uh, displaces a ch2 here ch3 uh, C uh, c2h5 becomes ch3 over here and ch3 becomes c2h5 simply swapping swapping things so this is how we can see it say that this is the transesterification okay so the alcohol part of the ester gets swapped substituted with the new alcohol so this is why the answer should be d okay transesterification so so fellas i hope that you have understood the question as well as the solution so if you have any question regarding this uh, solution please let me know in the comment section I am always there to help you out fellas. So until then stay cool, stay awesome and, uh, and as always peace with chemistry.